morning, YouTube. Oh, Dr. Soul, I like that blur effect that just happened now. So, yesterday, um, I told you that my, I woke up with my battery in 90% SOC. And um, we all agreed that that was incorrect. The BMS had had a few drinks and obviously did not relay the message properly and 90% was not correct state of charge. But yesterday, uh, while the battery was charging, it went from 90%, well, 92%, which was what it was at, to 90, 95%, and for four, 95, 97%. For four hours, it took over four hours for it to go from 97% to 100%. So yesterday we saw 100% again. So OGW, you and I have been having this conversation about um, SOCs, and you are absolutely correct. It measures it. Uh, it measures what goes in and out from a shunt, and until this battery actually discharges, the information that's going, the information that we're seeing is incorrect. So this morning at about three or four o'clock, the battery percentage was again ninety-two percent. And I was like, I am going to call my Solar X guys and tell them that the battery percentage is incorrect. Well, um, about 30, 40 minutes ago, I checked and you're surprised at what the battery percentage is. So let's start with the lights. Oh, by the way, I run the fridge, the freezer, the AC all through. So starting with the lights. See my SOC light? Okay, we don't have all the lights blinking as it was yesterday. So my SOC, as you could see, you don't have all four lights blinking anymore. Remember, it's graduated percentages all the way to 100%. So we only have one light blinking, but the green light is still on, which is good, because the last time, the first time when I had just one battery, it was the... Um, this was red. This was blink. This was blinking. It was then it turned amber. It started red, amber, and then it, it became a solid green when it's when, when, while it was charging. So that's a good sign. Very positive. So let's go in here and see what our battery percentage is. And let me make. Let's see what our discovery is. Our battery percentage is sixteen percent. So I've put everything off. I had to put them off this morning because I'm going out. Hopefully I'll be back. I set this to turn off at 16%, uh, sorry, at 15%, but because I now have two batteries, I've changed it to 10%. I'll change it back to 15% again. I think I'll get longer battery life from it that way. Let me see what our battery voltage is. System status. There should be nothing PV wise. And our battery voltage is 229.1. I'm discharging 0.4 amps or 103 watts. And the SOC is 16%. And our cell temperature is 35 degrees C. My friends in America, in North America, will be very happy to see 35 degrees C, which is pretty warm this time of year. For Well, it's pretty warm, but that is our cell temperature. So this, um, I think it gets all the way to 37. That's about as I have seen it so far. So, um, OGW, you are absolutely correct. Um, until this goes through its full cycle, all of you that have made comments, you're absolutely correct. Until this goes through its full cycle, um, what, I, what I would have seen so far is fictitious. So yesterday I got quite a bit. Today I'm not getting anything. So BMS has woken up and i'm psyched let me run it one one or two more days and hopefully i'll start to see real capacity as of these batteries if you like what you see give me a thumbs up if you had to subscribe please click the subscribe button once again this is dr solar coming to you from lagos nigeria